Hey guys, welcome back to Airport Sim. Today we are back and we are actually going to be working as ground crew yet again. Uh, I don't know what's actually going to be happening today. I think we're going to be able to use a bus today, which is pretty awesome. Uh, and yeah, there are going to be some planes coming in. We're going to have to use some stairs. It's going to be kind of cool. Uh, if you guys do enjoy these videos, let me know in the comments down below because, um, yeah, it'd be cool to do some more. Anyway, let's go ahead and see what our jobs are and get to them. Alright, so it looks like we have three departures. Uh, one is to Vagar, one is to Warsaw, and one is to Katowice. Uh, so, we're gonna start with this one because it is the first one to depart, and that is in half an hour. So, we need to connect a GPU, we need to then wait, uh, till now. Now is the time. Uh, and then we need to connect the stairs, load the passengers, disconnect the stairs, disconnect the GPU, uh, remove the cones, and then that's it for that aircraft. So, let's go ahead and figure out where that is, and get to it. Stand number 42. Alright, so it turns out stand number 42 is actually quite far away. Uh, I don't want to teleport or anything, I just want to go ahead and run there. So let's go ahead and get rid of this, and we'll run over there, let's go. I think that's the plane right there that we need to, uh, to deal with. Okay, so we've made it over here, and I don't know whether it's this one or the one next to us, actually. Let's have a little look. Uh, yeah, it's actually the one next to us. It is that one over there. So, um, there's a bunch of things that we need to do. The first thing is find a vehicle to uh, attach a GPU to it. This is our vehicle right here that we're going to need, and this is the GPU. So, let's go ahead and jump into this straight away. There we go. We'll go ahead and attach that guy on. Uh, and then we need to actually turn it on so that it works, otherwise we're going to have some issues. We then need to find some stairs, because I don't know where the stairs are actually at right now. So let's go ahead and park that right there, go ahead and connect it together. I get back inside, drive it over to the aircraft, and this will be fine. So I'm actually going to go ahead and drive straight underneath the aircraft. Because uh, I think we do fit, we do definitely fit, and we can leave it right there. Okay. So. Uh, let's have a little look. Is it underneath on this aircraft or is it to the side? Sometimes it's to the side, sometimes it's underneath. It looks like... Oh. Ah! Uh, yeah, no, it's here again. There it is. So we can open that up. We can go ahead and attach this guy straight into there, because we are a ground crew. We need to go ahead and turn this thing on. So click that button, click this button. I wish that I could read what this actually says. It's kind of annoying that we can't see. Uh, and there we go. I think that's good. Although I'm not entirely sure. So let's go to operations real quick. There you go, GPU is started. We now need to connect the stairs to the airplane. I don't know where the stairs are. I don't actually see... Oh, never mind. I found the stairs. <laughs> that was really easy. Anyway, uh, yeah, we're going to connect the stairs to the plane. And then we need to actually load some passengers. I don't know where they're going to come from, though. Because, uh... Yeah, I don't see the gate anywhere nearby. This is weird. Anyway, let's go to the external view so we can do this a little bit easier. Here we go, drive it straight over. Let's lift it up a little bit. Lift it up a lot, actually. There we go. That looks like it might work. Nah, there we go. It's a little bit higher than that. I think that's probably around, around the right height, maybe. Let's go back to the interior view and see if that's true. Nope. Oh, now it is. Alright, cool. Uh, go ahead and drop the legs on this thing. And then attach ourselves on. And there we go, we've connected the stairs to the aeroplane. Nice. Let's go up there, open the doors, and allow this to actually work. So there we go. Opening. The weather is terrible, by the way. The weather today is terrible. However, it is actually daytime, which it wasn't last time, so that's pretty cool. Anyway, drag this, drag this, and there we go. Now drive the bus to the terminal. Ah, this is what I really want to do, actually. I don't know where the bus is. I need to find a bus. Alright, there are literally no buses over here, so let's go ahead and jump inside this car and we'll actually drive over to where the buses are. Uh, and hopefully we'll be able to get in one very soon. So, they're quite far away. Uh, the passengers themselves actually really aren't far away, they're just there. So, let's just go ahead and find a bus. I think it's all the way on the other side of the airport, which is super annoying. But yeah, we'll get there in no time. Okay, here's our bus. I think we can use any of these. I don't think it really matters. Uh, I think I've just got in the passenger seat of this bus. Uh, so let's not do that. <laughs> let's go to the other side and drive this over to where we need to be. 
It is worth mentioning, it's actually kind of difficult to see where the lines are on the ground uh, when I'm driving, so I might try and follow the, uh, the rules a little bit, but I do think it's a little bit difficult. I'm not going to stop at the stop signs because there is nothing moving here. There is literally nothing moving. So yeah, we'll drive this over, pick up the passengers, and take them where they need to be, which is the plane. Okie dokie, not into- oh, whoops, just crashed, uh, but don't worry about that too much. So this is apparently where I need to park the bus, uh, in order for this to work. So let's go ahead and just get inside this area, I guess. Doors must be open. All right, let me open up the doors. Oh, you actually park like that. Hold on. Wait, what have I just crashed into? Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, wow. Why have they put that there? Okay, of all things, that's crazy. Anyway, how do I open up the doors? I might actually need to get out, get back inside, and press J. J to open up the left doors. Let's see if that's actually working. All right, doors are open. Where are the guys? Where are they even going to come from? Out of this... Where is... Where's the door? I don't know where these... Oh, whoa! Ah, oh, here it is. They're coming out of here. Okay, awesome. Everybody aboard, get on my bus, please. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Th Give me some money before you... You two look the... You three look the same. Wow, we got like triplets on. Nice. All right, well, anyway, I'm going to wait in the bus because it's cold. All right, turns out I've actually had my headphones on this entire time. So uh, it's actually been really, really quiet. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and close the doors. I believe they're closed now, and we're going to set off. So in order to get there, I am going to go left. I don't actually know if there's a way across here. So I'm going to turn right here and just go across the open. That is a risky move. I don't think I'm allowed to do that. In fact, I'm almost certain I'm not allowed to do that, but never mind. All right, guys. Is everybody ready to disembark the bus? Hopefully you guys are. Let's go ahead and park this up right here. There we go. I'm actually going to go to the external view so I can see whether the door's open. There we go. Everybody off, please. Thank you. Yeah, so now they are actually getting onto the plane. Excellent. Okay, so whilst they're loading, what is the next job for us? We need to disconnect the stairs. Okay, we can't really do that. Disconnect the GPU. We can't really do that. Uh, remove the cones. Uh, I guess we could do that, but not yet. We shouldn't do that yet. What if I actually get them to turn on the APU now? That might be a good idea. Let's see if they'll turn on the APU for me. APU, turn on. How do I know if they've done it? I've, like, I've signaled to do it, but maybe I do actually have to do it in order. That's a little bit annoying if that's true. Yeah, so we're just gonna have to wait for everybody to load. Ugh. There we go, that's everybody. All right, cool. So let's go ahead and remove the safety barriers because nobody else is coming in. Close the door and then we can disconnect the stairs and then we can do the APU and GPU stuff. So uh, disconnect it from there. Lift up our little leggies that are underneath and we can drive away. Uh, at least, at least I thought I could. Is my engine not on? Yeah, maybe my engine wasn't on. <laughs> there we go. Does help when you left when you actually turn the engine on to move a vehicle. All right, there we go. Let's go ahead and park this here. Turn the engine off. There we go. Right, we are now going to go ahead and disconnect the GPU because the APU is started. They did actually do that. Uh, in order to do this, I'm actually going to go ahead and do this. Boop. There we go. We can then disconnect that guy from there and attach it into there. Close this up, and there we go. Nice. All we need to do now is actually remove the cones. So I'm going to run around removing the cones real quick. Here we go. Yes. All right. Oh, there's loads more cones than I put down last time. All right. There we go. Oh, oh, we've run out of, we've run out of thingamabobbies. I can't remember how this actually works. Release object. Ah, uh, no, 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 no. Release cone stack is actually why. There we go. All right, cool. I need to pick up some more of these guys. So let's go ahead and get this one, this one. How many more is there? There's one in front of the engine, and then I believe I parked in front of one, although that's already gone. Okay, nice. Good. Cones. I think have actually been removed. Let's go ahead and press Y over here. Let's pick up this stack and move that over here as well. There we go. 
Apparently there's more. Does anybody see any more cones? Oh no, clear vehicles and cones. That's what it says. Alright, remove the chocks. Here we go. Let's do that next. So that one's been removed. This one's been removed. And this one's been removed. And remove the bypass pin. Da da da. There we go. Now all we need to do is move this guy out of the way. Preferably from the driver's seat, presumably. There we go. We can just drive it out of the way. Well, hey, nice. So as soon as I move this, we'll go ahead and move the bus. And that'll be the last thing that we actually need to move. And then we can move on to the next aircraft. Alright, let's turn the engine off. Run over the bus, move that out of the way, and... Yeah, I'm not sure which one is our actually our next aircraft, but that's fine. Go ahead and close the doors. Drive forwards. Into the vehicle bay. Whoops. I didn't mean to crash into that. <laughs> I didn't mean to, but there you go, I did. That's fine. Move this out of the way, and there we go. We actually did... We did succeed with this aircraft. It's ready to go. That's awesome. Alright, our next aircraft is actually on stand number 7. So we need to find that, and the one after that is actually at stand number 9. So they're very close together. Presumably, let's have a little look, see where that is. Uh, stand number 7 is actually right next to where we picked them up from. Okay, what do we need to do? Connect to GPU. Uh, da -da -da -da, wait for the service to start. We're miles away from that time. Uh, load the passengers. Clear. Move the jetway. Disconnect the GPU. Alright, okay. It's pretty much the same thing, except this time, instead of stairs, we get a jetway. So let's run over to our GPU unit. Here it is. Ground power unit. I don't know why I added unit to the end. Uh, we'll drive this over there. And wait, I guess. We break up and you slam the door. I messed up on the bedroom floor. What the hell do we do this for? I push you up, but you come back. Okie dokie, we are over here with our GPU. Yes, uh, I believe this is a different aircraft. So, uh, let's go ahead and stop right there. Uh, and, yes, on this one, it's actually on the side. So, is this... This is a 737, isn't it? And that one over there was an A320. Oh, and it's moving! Look, it's actually out of here. It's, it's reversing. Why didn't I get to tow that? Why didn't I get to push that back, even? That's annoying, but yeah, it just reversed out and it's now going away. But I think that's an A320, and then this is a 737. They're a little bit more squat, um, I think, and possibly even a little bit more pointy on the nose. Um, but the difference between them in terms of the GPU is the actual thingamabobby is on the side. So let's go ahead and grab this and shove it into there. There we go. Let's go ahead and turn this on. Power this one. We need to wait. We'll then turn this on, and we'll turn this on, and then that's it. I think that one's actually done. Uh, what I do need to do is actually click on this. Connect the jetway. All right, that's the next fun bit, so we get to attach this on. I'm not very good at driving these, but I'll try. So let's turn it sideways. We need to lower it down a lot, because this plane is very low. All right, so I want to go this way. Holy, yeah, these are kind of difficult to drive, because you don't know where things are. It's really weird. It is very, very weird. Alright, up we go. Yeah, it's actually, like, doing pretty well. We're at about the right height. There we go. Stairs must be attached. What do you mean? I don't know what that means. Stairs must be attached. My guy, you're using a jet bridge, not a... What? What? Okay, I am a little bit, a tiny bit confused, but I think what we actually need to do is wait for the service to actually start before we can even actually attach this on properly. So I think we got to wait another half an hour, question mark? I'm not sure. Okay, so apparently I can't actually skip time, so we're going to go ahead and figure out where the next one is, and we're going to start that as well. So connect a GPU to that one, wait for the service to start. There's no way I have to wait half an hour, right? There's no way. I guess I actually do. Anyway, where is stand number 9? Let's have a little look. So, maps. Uh, number 9 is on the other side. Is it this one? It must be this one. Alright, so it's actually on the other side of this building. I can just run there. Uh, although, I do need this. I do. But maybe there's one on that side of the building anyway. Let's go have a look. 
Okay, so it is going to be a Wiz Air A320, I believe. So let's go ahead and try and find ourselves a Tug. Or at least a little vehicle that we can get a GPU onto. And then we need to find a GPU to actually take it over there. Because uh, there isn't any right here. Please say I can get in this one. Yes, I can. Okay, I think we're going to have to drive around to try and find one of those GPUs. There is one definitely on the other side next to that other aircraft. So we'll probably take that. Yeah, okay, I see it. So this is one right here. Let's go ahead and turn ourselves around. Whoa, there we go. Nice. Uh, we will reverse up to this guy. There we go. And I think we should be able to attach it from there, but I could be wrong. Alright, I can, I can actually turn it sideways and connect it on. Okay, let's go. Engines on, let's drive. So yeah, we're going to take this back around to that other aircraft. And uh, we'll connect this one as well. And that'll be good. Okay, so I parked up next to it. Uh, I believe this is one of those aircraft with the thingamabobby underneath. Yes, it is. Uh, we'll go ahead and grab this guy and we'll plug it in right there. There we go. There's not really too much I need to do other than that, so let's just go ahead and do this. Turn it on, push this button. There we go. We then need to do this one and this one, and that should be good as well. Nice. Ready to go. Okay, so I know it's not really time for this yet, but I'm going to go ahead and run around and pick up all the cones around this aircraft because, uh, yeah, I've got nothing else to do right now, so... And I can't skip time, so I might as well do some of the jobs that we're going to have to do later anyway. Uh, so yeah, I'll do it now. Here we go. Let's drop this into here. Very nice. Let's go ahead and grab the rest of them. There's, there's actually quite a few cones. So grab this one and this one and this one. We're going to have to do the chocks later too, but I won't do that just yet. I'm going to run around to the other aircraft and I'm going to actually remove the cones from that as well. Uh, I, again, I know it's not a good idea, but I've got nothing else to do, so we might as well. Okie dokie, give me this, there we go, very nice, give me that, and this, alright, continue to the other side. We need this one, and this one, and I don't know whether I'll be able to lift that one, nope. So let's go ahead and put this in the basket over here, because we can. Da -da 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 -da. Press Y, excellent, and then we need to pick up some more. In fact, there might only be one more, and it's just this one right here. So I'll pick this up. Uh, we'll then do the chocks later on once we've done the jet bridge and stuff like that. In fact, can I do the jet bridge on this one? Does it need it? I'm not sure. Uh, did it jet? Yeah. All right, cool. Let's go ahead and do this. Did it? Did it? Did do 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 do. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and essentially drive this over here. Yes. Okay, it's working. Use. Uh, lower it down a little bit. Actually, maybe not that much. There we go. Try and spin it around to the right, and I think that's good enough for us. Okay, cool. I think we're ready. This is awesome. Not gonna lie, I figured I'd go on a bit of an adventure, so we are on top of the aircraft right now. Can I get up the top of the tail? Uh, the answer is... Yes, I can. There we go. Would you look at that? We're at the top of the tail. Awesome. Nice. Well, I mean, this is looking nice and everything. We can actually see the tail of the other aircraft over there that we also have to deal with. Um, but I think we are very close to the time where I can actually do something. I'm literally just waiting till 2 o'clock. There must be a button. There has to be a button that I can do to make this skip time. Surely, right? Because otherwise I've got to wait another half an hour to actually do that one over there. And it doesn't take half an hour to do this. Unbelievable. We do only have a minute left, but oh, I just fell through there. Okay, you can't run across the top of that piece then, it seems. But anyway, uh, we are. It's two o'clock. Can I connect the jetway? Let's go, 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 go. Uh, stairs must be attached. What does that even mean? What do you mean by that? Stairs must be attached. Connect the jetway, my guy, not the step. What? Oh, there we go. It's letting me. It is letting me. Yes! I mean, it doesn't look like it's attached very well, but sure. There we go! Nice! Okay, good. So, I think I've connected the jetway. I, th I think that is acceptable. The passengers are about to start loading, so they're about to start walking down there, I guess? Oh no, they are just teleporting to here instead. They should walk from there, surely. But no, they're just walking across this bit. That's fine. Okay, I don't care. Anyway, uh, the next piece that we need to do is actually retract the canopy. Okay, move the jetway to the rest area. That's fine. Uh, disconnect the GPU, start the APU, 
Uh, da -da -da -da, remove vehicles and cones. Remove the bypass bin. So yeah, this is actually going to be relatively easy to do because all we need to do is remove the trucks, start the APU, remove this, uh, remove that, and we're good to go. How many passengers is there? 46. Okay, fine. I'm going to be a little bit naughty here. I'm actually going to go ahead and see if the flight crew will turn on their APU now. I'm going to go ahead and assume that they did do it. So I'm now going to disconnect this. There we go. I'm going to go ahead and click stop. That's fine. We will remove the pin. Oh, it won't let me. It won't let me remove the pin yet. I think I do actually legit have to wait a little bit. But that's okay. We can move this out of the way in this time. Start the engine. Move it forwards. Here we go. Lovely jubbly. We're going to go ahead and park this on the road, <laughs> it seems. No, I'll just go ahead and park it here. That's good. There we go. Turn off the engine. Get out. Good. And now all we have to do is remove the canopy. Uh, enter. There we go. They are closing the door. And then I should be able to move this back to the rest area. I want to do it from the outside, though. So... Let's see if we can actually retract it. Here we go. Oh, it's weird. The way this works is kind of strange. But yeah, it's coming back around. The rest area is over here somewhere. Nice. Yes, there we go. And I'd say that's okay. So now all we need to do is remove the trucks, remove the bypass pin, and this aircraft is ready to go. So there we go. Remove this. Remove that. Remove this guy, and remove this guy, and yeah, I guess it'll go again. So that's it. That is that aircraft successfully finished, and it will take off on time. Which is excellent, because that's exactly what I wanted it to do. Anyway, let's dump these guys. Oh, I can't actually seem to put them in there. I've just got chocks in my hands. It's kind of annoying. Okay. F? I don't know how to get rid of them. But anyway, that plane is ready to go. Now we just have to wait another half an hour for the next plane. I can't believe I'm waiting half an hour. That's ridiculous. Uh-oh. Uh, I just got an achievement, uh, and it was to let an aircraft take off with an open flap. So I think um, we actually left the, um, the port open when we uh, disconnected it, unfortunately. So uh, it took off with an open uh, flap, which is really annoying, actually. But anyway, um, we are still waiting. And we are going to be waiting for another, like, 15 minutes before we can do all of this stuff. Um, but what's going to be really fun is actually doing the pushback. So let's get ourselves a vehicle that's able to do that and get it over here. There's no point in waiting without it, so let's go find one. All right, guys, so we are in a pushback. Let's go ahead and grab ourselves... Uh, actually, turn on the engine, I suppose. Uh, we'll go to the outside view, yes, and I think we will actually attach a tow bar to the back Just so that we can take it over to where we need to go, uh, and that'll be fine. So reverse this up to there. There we go Go ahead and attach it on if we can. There we go. Good And yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and drive it over to where we need to be and then once we've done that We just have to wait We break up and you slam the door I messed up on the bedroom floor What the hell do we do this for? I push you up, but you come back That attraction, we can't fight that Oh, keep telling myself that I should let go But I hold on And oh, keep telling myself that I should move on But I don't, cause we got that mess Okay, so uh, driving this over here was interesting. One of the things I would say about this game, the only thing that is really, really not right uh, is actually these things right here. They don't work correctly at all. They seem to skid around all over the place. Uh, they don't drive really where you want them to go, which is really strange. Uh, and yeah, that's, that's the one thing that I would definitely say about this. These tow bars are very weird. They're very, very weird. Anyway, we are still waiting. We have another, like, 10 minutes to wait before we can actually do anything. But we are totally ready to go whenever we do need to go. So, I'm happy with that. Oh, look at that. It actually says 0% on our previous one because it took off with the uh, the actual uh, 
thingamabobby open. Because the door was open, uh, this failed. Which is really annoying because that shouldn't actually, uh, yeah. I, I just forgot to close it. And it was more within my frustration of having to wait an extra half an hour on top of that to actually do anything, which is really annoying. Uh, yeah, okay. Well, uh, you know what? That's fine. That was my fault. My fault completely. But um, this... Kind of annoying. So, uh, we are now at the point where we can actually attach this on, so let's go ahead and just do that. There we go, so that one is attaching, the door is opening, that's good. We can then walk away from that, and... I don't know whether we've already told the guy to start his engine, uh, his APU. I'm not sure, but let's go to this. APU, turn on. There we go, I'm now gonna go ahead and disconnect this and hope that that's fine. Uh, so, disconnect it. There we go, excellent. And what we'll do is we'll actually close this now. There we go. Guys, I disconnected it and I closed it. Does that now mean that it's successful? I'm not sure. Hopefully. All right, let's drive this out of the way. We don't want it to be here. Do, 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 do. We can just park it next to this jet bridge. That's okay. Uh, turn off the engine. Get outside. There we go. And now all we need to do is wait for the passengers to get on board. We'll retract the canopy. This one's already done. This one's already done, except we do need to remove the chocks. And then we need to wait for pushback clearance, which is going to take a little bit of time. And then we can go ahead and do that. Nice. Okay, so we can now remove the canopy and remove the jet bridge completely. So let's go ahead and do that. Bosh. There we go. Good. Uh, let's go to the exterior view. And I think we can just, like, reverse this. I think so. So we'll just, we'll just push, I guess, S. There you go. We'll direct this in. So it works from these little wheels down at the bottom right there. Uh, and that worked out fine. All right, cool. All we got to do now is remove the chocks. And then we're ready for pushback, I think. So remove that. We're not going to remove the key. Uh, the, the key? The uh, pin, I guess. Pushback plane. Move away from the plane. That's what we need to do. So in the seat. Where am I pushing it back to? Oh, wait. It's not even connected. Why are you stood there? Wait. Wait, what's going on? Why is this guy stood right here? What is he doing? Oh, what are you doing? Oh, he's talking to the uh, the pilot. That's cool. All right, I'm jacking this up. I'm jacking it up a lot more. There we go. I can't actually connect this up. I don't know how I'm supposed to do a pushback if I can't connect it. I'm confused. Ah, uh, yeah, look at that. So I don't think they're actually starting their APU when I'm when I'm telling them to. So we actually we failed on that one again. Uh, wait for pushback clearance. We do have pushback clearance. However, we can't actually push it back because uh, we can't actually connect on to it. So I don't know what I'm supposed to do in this situation. But let's try and reverse a little bit. There we go. All right, cool. Drive into it slightly. All right. Let's see if this is now. Is that now connected? I don't think so. No, it's not. Alright. I don't know. That looks like it's perfect, but I need to drive forwards a tiny bit more. In order to actually attach it onto there, so let's go ahead and do that a little bit. There we go, and attach! Hey! There we go, nice. Alright, cool. So, we gotta drive uh, this way. Do, 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 do. We gotta drive this way in order to turn the plane around. Whoa, okay. This guy's wire is annoying. But that's fine. Yeah, so we're doing a pushback. This is cool. I'm not sure which way the aircraft actually wants to be going either. I think uh, it wants to be facing to the left. So we're just gonna go ahead and start pushing it back that way as if it is gonna look left. There we go. Okay, very nice. And we can leave it sort of just like this. I think that's fine. Alright guys, I did a bit of a boo-boo, but now I'm trying to fix it by bringing this guy this way. There we go. And then maybe I can bring him this way as well. Okay, and then I can probably push him back into there, which is, yeah, not really what we wanted to do in the first place, but that's okay. Uh, I feel like... Oh, yeah, I feel like this is somewhat fine. I think we've moved it into the right place. Uh, we now just need to actually disconnect and leave it here. It's not on the line by any means, but it is facing the right direction. And it is definitely in the box. So it's sort of ready to go. Lovely. Okay, look, what are you doing? Hey, what are you doing to my 
get off that! Get off that! I'm disconnecting this and I'm gonna drive away before this madman does anything weird. Goodbye. Wait, he's chasing me. Why is he chasing me? Why is this man chasing me? Help! Help, there's a madman on the loose! He's running after me! He's on the phone, but he's chasing! Leave me alone! Leave me alone! Help! Somebody help me! There's a ground worker chasing me around! Leave me alone! Look at him, he's just chasing me! Alright, I'm just gonna leave this here. I'm gonna get out and I'm gonna run. Cause that's scary. See ya! I'm out of here. Alright, cool. So, I'm gonna go ahead and say that the plane has been pushed back. Uh, that guy, I don't know where he went, but he's gone now. Uh, and that is it. So, we failed two of them because of the GPU issue. Uh, I took it off too soon. Uh, essentially, and I don't think they started the APU properly, but that's that's okay. That's just me being very impatient I think in real life that would be fine um, But yeah, anyway um, For now, I'm gonna go ahead and say thank you guys very much for watching this video If you guys want to see more, let me know in the comments down below, and I'll see what I can do But for now, thanks for watching. See you next time. Goodbye